afternoon. Happy, happy Friday. Are you having a good day today? I hope so. I really hope so. Oh, it's actually nice outside. It's not hot or anything, but it's nice. It's the kind of weather where you can put on a really light sweater and just spend the day outside because it's not too breezy. It's not too anything. It's just lovely. <laughs> There's a part of me who didn't want to come home. I wanted to go out to like Courthouse Creek to their farm location where they actually make everything and just sit out there. <laughs> but it's like 45 minutes away and I was like, no, <laughs> no. Plus, I'm supposed to be talking about <laughs> my splendid. <laughs> I may have a little bit. Um, I'm sure there's people who have more than I do. But this is my collection so far, plus plus what's on my wrist today to complement my outfit. So uh, this is between two orders. So I basically have done two pretty substantial orders. Um, I love this stuff, actually. You know, it's the thing that I wanted, the subject I wanted to talk about along with just how much I like what they, oops, sorry guys, what they have is that I kept thinking I needed to pick a style. I needed to pick a thing or a box. And as much as I keep thinking, oh, I hate that we have to put ourselves in boxes. I hate that we feel like we have to be this or be that or define ourselves in these different ways. Um, I still do it, even though I hate it. It's just like this thing that's ingrained and it's annoying as all get out. Because I kept thinking, oh, I don't wanna be, you know, someone who's outlandish with the style and bold and so extra because you have on all this really bright stuff. And then I was like, but why don't I wanna do that? What is it? Oh, well, it's because I like the traditional stuff. I like the stuff that looks a little bit more, um, just classy and timeless and I do I really do I really really do but I also like this stuff and I had been thinking about getting some bangles for a while so when I got my first order I got like these um, plus um, a couple actually I think yeah I think these these two and this black one Oh, you can't see that. <laughs> Sorry. These two and this black one plus these here and this plus this white one and then these here in the center. So about half of this collection. Um, I Good afternoon. Happy, happy Friday. You having a good day today? I hope so. I really hope so. Oh, it's actually nice outside. It's not hot or anything, but it's nice. It's the kind of weather where you can put on a really light sweater and just spend the day outside because it's not too breezy. It's not too anything. It's just lovely. <laughs> There's a part of me who didn't want to come home. I wanted to go out to like Courthouse Creek to their farm location where they actually make everything and just sit out there. <laughs> but it's like 45 minutes away and I just like, no, <laughs> no. Plus, I'm supposed to be talking about <laughs> my splendid. <laughs> I may have a little bit. Um, I'm sure there's people who have more than I do. But this is my collection so far, plus, plus what's on my wrist today to complement my outfit. So uh, this is between two orders. So I basically have done two pretty substantial orders. Um, I love this stuff, actually. You know, it's the thing that I wanted, the subject I wanted to talk about along with just how much I like what they, oops, sorry guys, what they have is that I kept thinking I needed to pick a style. I needed to pick a thing or a box and as much as I keep thinking, oh, I hate that we have to put ourselves in boxes. I hate that we feel like we have to be this or be that or define ourselves in these different ways. Um, I still do it, even though I hate it. It's just like this thing that's ingrained and it's annoying as all get out because I kept thinking, oh, I don't want to be, you know, someone who's outlandish with the style and bold and so 
extra because you have on all this really bright stuff and then I was like but why don't I want to do that what is it oh well it's because I like the traditional stuff I like the stuff that looks a little bit more um just classy and timeless and I do I really do I really really do but I also like this stuff and I had been thinking about getting some bangles for a while so when I got my first order I got like these um plus um a couple actually i think yeah i think these these two and this black one oh you can't see that <laughs> sorry these two and this black one plus these here and this plus this white one and then these here in the center so about half of this collection um i purchased i really liked the carved the carved pieces i thought they were really really cool i liked the deep details on it a lot um and still do and so what i thought to myself is oh well if i get these it gives me an array of colors and complementary pieces and then i can just kind of add in a little bit of the narrow ones to kind of help show the different sizes and have some fun with it and that's what I did. And then I started realizing I want more colors and I really wanted more of the duo tones. And this is, um, their more, more recent collection are these duo tones and they're so much fun. Um, they're just, they're so, and these, these, these two and this one pink are the only pink I have because it's just not a color I wear that often. Um, which is part of the reason why I didn't get anything in this shade the first time I ordered anything. But then I was like, yeah, but you have this one really, really pale pink t-shirt and you have one pink sweater that has the black roses on it. Plus you could wear it with blue. You could wear it with black. You could, you know, wear it with a lot of other things and use it as a standout color, something that really accents, um, what your style is that day. And I was like, yeah, okay. So these are two from the more recent order, and so is this one. It's so much fun. I know I have a fun filter on that adds sparkles to everything. It's just having fun, because that's what I do on Fridays. Um, I don't do a filter every day during the week. When I do my morning stuff, I only do it in the afternoon for these videos, because I believe in showing the reality. And yes, I am wearing makeup, so it's not providing me makeup. Um, but yeah, it's just, it's really cool. It's got this awesome iridescence to it. So I'm going to set this aside because this is my stack for today. Uh, but if you didn't, well, you can look back later at the beginning to see what that stack looked like. Cause I just pulled it apart and I don't remember what order I put that in. So that would take me a minute, but I think it's really cool. Some people are probably like, why do you need that many? Who needs anything except for water and housing and heat and air conditioning, which is kind of actually a luxury when you think about it. Um, and your like just your basic necessities. Those are the needs. Everything else is a lovely want and they're so lovely. <laughs> this is actually my first pair of earrings from them. Um, again, it was like this push of, yeah, but they're really cute. They're on sale. It matches this, this one right here. And I have, I have a midi in that size as well. And I have one of the wides. So it's a nice complimentary. And I was like, Oh, just get it. It's like $3.50. Well, actually it's in pounds, but, um, yeah, so I got it and I really, really like them. So now I'm like, I want to get a whole bunch of earrings. <laughs> Um, so I'm building up my Splendette points so that I can put that towards getting earrings because I've purchased so much and I'm doing reviews on things on their website. So you get points for all that and yeah, I'll put it towards getting some earrings. What I wanted to show, yeah, this one legitimately does not fit on here. So I've officially maxed out. <laughs> like I've, I, when I put everything on here, including those small ones, it is full to the brim. I can barely fit on these ones that I showed you that I already had on my wrist and that's it. I can't fit. I can't fit one more bangle on here. So if I end up getting any more, I'll just get another one of these little stands, which it really wasn't that expensive. I mean, it's a little wobbly, but it works and I'm careful with it. But I think it was like 16 or $17. And I like that I can see it because I ordered one of their box cases. It has like an atomic print on it and it's really, really fun. I love the case and I will definitely keep using it because when we went down to Florida, I put, I created like, um, four different stacks 
but they were things that I could intermix so I could use them for the different days while we were traveling um, and still have some fun, but I wasn't bringing everything with me. I think I brought like half of what I had at the time. <laughs> I probably got enough that would easily fill this, um, but it was great. You know, I set it in these little cubbies that are inside of it because it's broken into four little cubbies, put the different stacks that I wanted in there. I stuffed um, the pins that I wanted to wear each day. So it was kind of like I had things preset, but I also put some hair stuff in there and I was just able to really utilize that container um, more than I thought I would. So I'm really glad <laughs> that I got it. Really, really glad. So um yeah so let's take a look at some of this stuff and kind of just i mean how a very 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 newbie would put together some stacks um one of the fun things that i saw someone do today actually in one of their pictures was mix in teal and brown and i only ha i have like this little section of brown right here um i got it because i thought i could accent it with black or with blue or with green i you know but at first it was a push because i was like i don't really have anything that's brown <laughs> but there's so much you can do with it and i had to get every one that was in this color oh it's because of the filter i need to learn it looks on my phone like it's coming at more of a blue but this is actually very very much a teal color like a jade kind of teal like in between because jade is very green but it's in between being jade and being a teal color and it's very close to my branding so I was like I have to get everyone that's in that color and when they came out with the duo tones that were similar in color um and had some you know had some contrasting lighter shades kind of like this pink it was in the same color or very similar color and then had a lighter green inside of it oh god i wanted all of it all that were that color i just <laughs> chill out stephanie you don't need to buy all of those colors you need to intermix things but i do like the deep carves that are on these i think it's really cool to have that fine detail and it's the same with a lot of these you can see there and this one this is by far one of my favorites i love this one um it can be a little sharp to take off if you're not careful because of that tight and very very precise cut but it just this is so much fun so what i saw some people do and i thought to myself oh, that makes so much sense is i hope they come out with more that are kind of like this this kind of clear colored ones they had a whole bunch there um, on the website, that mean, I mean, but, um, oh my gosh, what was I gonna say? But a lot of them were either in the size up or the size smaller, and I really wanna be picky about my sizing and keep the sizing in one way. I know that I can put a larger bangle in between, and the smaller ones will actually keep it on my wrist, but there's gonna be times when I'm gonna want to move things in different spaces and if I always have to have it in a certain spot, I just didn't, I don't know. At this point in time, I didn't wanna do that. I just didn't, so, um, but they're just, they're so cool. So I saw someone take the teal and intermix it. Whoa, let's see if I can do this. Whoop. With some brown and I was just like, oh, that's actually really cute and again it's coming up more blue just remember it's teal but it still looks cool even with the blue and the brown and then you know you can do something like that or take the lay of the cafe au lay um collections and do something like this i was like that is so much fun i never would have thought about really putting those together so there's just you know, I have so many now that I can do all kinds of collections. And it's funny, I've <laughs> I've noticed I've started thinking to myself, what kind of bangle set do I want to put together? <laughs> and that's how I'm choosing, you know, what I want to wear. So you could put, you know, similar colors together if you wanted to. You could, you know, I could accent and I could pull the teal in with the pink if I wanted to. Um, there's just so, there's so much that you can do with these and I was actually looking at this when I was pulling these off and I wanted to see what this looked like. So what better time than now? Let me put stuff away here. Set that like that for now. Um, 
I actually, oh, I, did, I forgot. I do have a lot more narrow than I do of the others because I think this is the easiest way, at least for me, to mix in without having the stacks be too big. Uh, for me, that is. I wanted to look at this with these. So, that's kind of fun. I like that combination. These are the Honeysuckle and Freesia from the new Duo Tones. Um, this is a midi and these two are the narrow and then this is a wide. So, but I just, I like having the different sizes. It's really fun. And then I could also, I mean, if you really want to, if you really want to pull it, <laughs> pull it all out together, you could do something like this and I could even, So that we have middies on either end and it's a little bit more spread out do something like this where there's a midi here and then there's narrows but like, i mean how much fun is that it's so much fun i love this stuff i'm seriously like if they <laughs> i have to keep i have to be careful because yeah well i mean i am careful so this was actually when I told my husband that I just bought more and bought like a lot more because they were a lot of these were on sale, not the duo tones, but some of the other stuff from older collections that they're trying to get rid of. Um, I told him I bought more and he was like, how much did you spend? And I was like, um, he was like $300. And I was like, oh, no, not that bad. <laughs> I like have that, um, which is a blessing. Like it's a blessing. Believe me, I, I know that it is a blessing to be able to do that. Um, and it's. I've never been someone who really spent a lot of money on myself. I've never really had that opportunity. So it's been nice. Oh, that's right. I can't fit it on there. I have to put it on the next row up. Any other middies? But yeah, they're just, I think these are a lot of fun. Um, I, I've really just, yeah, I've been having a lot of fun with these and I've been really excited about what I can do with it. And it's been, this fun thing that I can do, I can then, you know, turn around and go, hmm, what do I want to wear tomorrow? I want to set out my clothes so I'm not thinking about it. And I, go, I usually start thinking to myself, what kind of bangles do I want to wear? <laughs> as silly as that may sound, it's, <sighs> it's the truth. It's the truth. Can't even lie. Just can't. Um, I think one of my other favorites that I've done as far as combos, I have this fun shirt that is Harry Potter. I don't know if you saw it. I showed, I did a little reel of it. Um, well, I tried to be careful, but there's these fun sparkly ones. And I thought to myself, that's too much. That's too much before I wasn't going to do it, but I bought, I just bought it. This one, it, it says it's supposed to be gun metal, but it actually looks a little bit more purple to me. This is very much like a lime green. And then this one is more of like a sea foam. Um, but yeah, I ended up taking, I didn't do the green green, but I did this. And then I think, what was it that I did? I can't even remember now. Um, but this is a fun, this is a fun combo. I'm sorry if that's loud, but yeah, like that's a fun, that's a fun greens combo. See, it looks, let me see if I can't, let me turn this. There we go. So this, look at that. Isn't that a fun, that's a fun combo of different kinds of greens. So if you've got on a green shirt or even a pink shirt or something, and you want to complement it with something else, like that's just, there's so much fun that you can have with these. And yeah, so I've really gotten into them clearly. Um, and I'm excited to, I'm excited to keep developing my style and what, how, how I want to express myself because it's really, it's really easy to start justifying or trying to justify why we should or should not do something, why we should or should not dress a certain way. And um, it just, that seriously sucks. It really, really sucks because 
we deserve to have fun while we have time on this planet. We deserve to live a full, brilliant, bold, beautifully empowered life and nothing less than that. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I forgot one. It's just, it's it sucks not living anything other than that. And when I, when I first started getting allowing myself to be more free and actually live the way I wanted to live and dress the way I wanted to dress. I can't tell you how many times I walked outside. Like I would get ready, I'd get my hair ready and I'd get my makeup together and I would think to myself, I'm really happy. I like the way I look. I think it's really fun. Oh gosh, what are people gonna... Mm, am I gonna get weird looks? I don't wanna get weird looks. Am I gonna get weird looks? Are people gonna say things? Are people gonna, you know, because I had that happen before. Um, but, you know, you just, the more you do it, the more you just feel comfortable with it. And furthermore, I noticed more compliments than anything else. And I have to say, I think 50% of that is all in how you carry yourself too. If you are happy with what you're doing, in life with your, if you're happy with how you're living, if you're happy with how you're dressing and you're not putting yourself in boxes and saying, I have to be this way or I have to be that, I can only be traditional and true to traditional style and what they would have actually done versus these crazy colors of bangles and big earrings and big hair. It's just actually live the way I wanted to live and dress the way I wanted to dress. I can't tell you how many times I walked outside like I would get ready, I'd get my hair ready and I'd get my makeup together and I would think to myself, I'm really happy, I like the way I look, I think it's really fun. Oh gosh, what are people gonna, mm, am I gonna get weird looks? I don't wanna get weird looks, am I gonna get weird looks? Are people gonna say things? Are people gonna, you know, because I had that happen before. Um, but you know, you just, the more you do it, the more you just feel comfortable with it and Furthermore, I noticed more compliments than anything else. And I have to say, I think 50% of that is all in how you carry yourself too. If you are happy with what you're doing in life, with your, if you're happy with how you're living, if you're happy with how you're dressing and you're not putting yourself in boxes and saying, I have to be this way or I have to be that. I can only be traditional and true to traditional style and what they would have actually done versus these crazy colors of bangles and big earrings and big hair. It's just no way to live if you do that. We can be feminine while enjoying tomboy elements of ourselves. We can love to get dressed up and love to put on some loungewear. We can, we can love all the things. We do not have to be one way or another. It's, it's anything. It's whatever you want to make it. And that's part of the beauty of creating yourself and being yourself. You find a way to put together the things that you want to put together, the life that you want to put together for you, and you go for it and you live it and you have fun with it and that's all there is to it and I don't remember if this is how I put it together before but this is what I'm doing now because <laughs> today I felt like mostly mostly middies I only have one or mostly narrows I only have one midi in here and these are all narrows but I felt like all the pink and black and red and that's fine that's good some days I don't like to do much makeup some days I don't want to put on any lipstick sometimes I don't want to do my hair sometimes I don't even want to get dressed and we take it one day at a time but we deserve to live in ways that make us feel happy we deserve if we can financially afford it and I understand that that's a whole other ball of wax so the people that I'm talking with are people that are in the same position in me and you give when you can and you help when you can but you also help take care of yourself because if you don't take care of yourself you can't give to anything else or to anyone else and you're just you have nothing to give so you're basically running yourself on empty or in a deficit and it's just that's a straight path to a disaster so if you can 
find something like a massive collection of bangles to make you happy, find something, sorry, I'm doing that all over again. Um, find something that makes you smile. Find something that will cheer you up and go for it. She says that she hungle, hugs all her bangles. <laughs> but it's true. You know, these, these ones, these little ones, they're like five bucks. They're not that expensive, you know? And I think the most expensive are these and they're like 19. It's really not, that's not bad. You know, you buy a few at a time. They're so much fun. I just love them. So I hope you guys are having a good day. I hope you guys find something like this that makes you smile. I hope you find something in life that will give you some cheering up if you need it. I hope you take time to take care of yourself and I hope that you remember above all that you are wonderful and incredible and capable of all the things you want to do, whether that's sitting on your butt because you've been running yourself ragged or pushing yourself a little bit harder or thinking, you know what? I'm tired of trying to force whatever situation to happen. I'm going to take every day as it is and love myself. I'm going to walk into the mirror first thing in the morning and say, good morning, gorgeous. Okay, I don't even do that. But I do think about things that I'm grateful for every morning because it just helps put me in a good mental headspace. So I'm grateful to you if you're watching this, which obviously if you're hearing me, then you are. So, hey, I'm grateful for you. <laughs> and I hope you have a great day. I hope you have a nice weekend. And I hope you have a wonderful finish to April. Happy spring, everybody, and uh, happy bangle stacking. See you later. <laughs>